What up, YouTube? This is your boy, Chef Speaks, once again, courtesy at ESPN MMA. What up, y'all? Sean Strickland is down to jump in the boxing ring some one of these days, y'all. And I can actually see that happening because he's a pretty good, like, seeing how he maneuvers and uses the Philly shell really effectively and, you know, to his to his natural alignment is pretty impressive. I actually like to see it done properly. So I, I could honestly see Strickland, you know, being in the boxing ring one of these days. And Strickland went on to say, and I quote, I spar a lot of high level boxers and they always say one thing. Why don't you get in why don't you box? Maybe one day for a big money fight. Now me personally, I would love to see Strickland fight a uh, like an influencer just to derail the influencer hype train because even though yeah, it makes some good money for boxing, it's also rather embarrassing. That's just my personal opinion. But I could see you Strickland put on the boxing gloves, man. Let you know, let me know what y'all think in the comments below, man. What do y'all think? Y'all think Strickland can get it done? Let your boy know in the comments below. And we're actually gonna get on to my next video as well. My sorry, my next slide right here. Kamar Usman and Robert Whitaker, y'all. What do y'all think? Do y'all think Bobby Knuckles got it? Because Rob, you know, Robert Whitaker was just like, yo, look, I think Usman should stay at middleweight. He says, he you know, he said, look, I don't know. That fight interests me. I like that fight. I'd fight a middleweight Usman. I don't think it's a bad fight to have. Now, former champions in their own right. Right now, you know, we've got to give Kamaru some time to really readjust and re refortify and reinforce his mentality, his mental health. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, after taking, you know, three consecutive losses, that's going to, you know, demean and down out, you know, any man or any fighter. Um, I've seen it plenty of times, man. So I think Kamaru's going to be right back where he needs to be at, man. I think he just needs to learn to uh, just to adapt and just to pace himself, but then also give himself some grace as well um, in a sense where, you know, look, man. Three losses is not bad, you know. Everyone's been on a little bit of a skid. But, you know, these, you know, I want to say this too. Kamaru's fights, his losses rather, uh, his lessons, were not these these emphatic things. Okay, yes, the head kick KO at the very last minute, you know, against the fight against Leon Edwards, that's one thing. But the other two have only been decisions, and those have been very close fights. So, you know, I echo the same, cha you know, echo the same chamber as many people in the comment section, man, like... Usman, you know, I understand, bro. You know, you're going to feel how you feel. Embrace that. And, you know, give yourself some grace. But, just, however, just know that, you know, you didn't flat out, like, lose. You know, don't be down on yourself, bro. You're not a loser. You know, so I look forward to seeing what, what goes down for sure. You know, if Robert Whitaker and Usman ever fight. Let me, let me know what y'all think in the comments below, man. Deuces.